What's poppin'? We back with another video. I'm Jay. And I am B. It is Jay and B TV. Okay, we back with some more scary reaction. Y'all can already tell by my face, I am up against the wall right now. Yeah, so over the, it. You I'm, don't want to do it no I more. am really over it. So the first video that we did had me against the ropes. I mean, like, almost 10 count. Right. But we found out that <laughs> it wasn't recording properly. So... Yeah, so. We did it the second, well, not the same video. We did another, we did another video. video. That's the video that y'all watched first, mm -hmm. and that had us against the wall. There, that's why we had to stop, stop it because stop it, yeah. it was too much. We don't do chants in this household. Yes, Sorry, too don't. much prayer, too much, you know, God. So we ain't gonna do that. We will do scary shit because you know, scary yeah. things. You can be scary. scary. We, we still do Halloween. We still do. Right. But when it comes to chants Chanting and stuff, and nah, I'm about that. No, ma'am. No, about that. No, ma'am. So, we're going to do this third one. Well, second one for y'all. And um, we're going to do the TikTok, scary TikTok co compilations. Yeah. Scary. Uh, and see, you know, my biggest thing is jump scares. So oh, it's the really creepiest that. TikTok videos compilation. Yeah. So. I hate loud noises. Like, yeah. Like, I don't really get, I don't really get, okay, this is going to really make y'all sound, going to make me sound dumb, but I'm just going to get it out. I don't really get scared easily. I know that may sound weird, but... I don't like like screams and noises like yeah, like yeah. in the movie theaters. Yeah, yeah. It'll just be like silent, and it just be like <clears throat> like it's just like like a lot of scary stuff I can deal with. Like it, like if a lot of shit was real, I can deal with. Like, if, but I think the scare, I think the reason why it's called being scary mm -hmm. is because like it does what you don't want. Yeah, don't want you to. Do. So like all the extra like what are you waiting for? Like mm -hmm. that, that'd be my biggest thing. It's not even about being scared. It's just like okay, like you you did the most. Like yeah. you know what I mean? Like because yeah. then afterward you don't even feel like you've been scared. So it, whatever it case to be, uh, whatever the fuck, mm -hmm. whatever I just say, I'm just rambling. But other than that, we're gonna get right into the second one. Uh, TikTok scariest TikToks. Yeah, um, creepiest TikTok. So mm -hmm. let's get it started. Let's go. This if this scary, this might be the last one. Yeah, for, for real. <laughs> Yeah, y'all gonna get two today. Right, so let's get right into it. Let's go. This is the story of my haunted apartment. This is the apartment, and these are the kids that haunt it. Today, I was walking inside. You won't believe what I saw. Hey, buddy, how you doing? What, what are you smelling over there? Huh, that's weird. The pool's closed right now. Well, it sounds like somebody's in there. Right, either way, better go upstairs. Good boy. What's that? What, what, what? Holy potato sauce! Holy potato sauce. TV's on the left, yeah. the window's on the right. If you save the video and zoom in, you'll see the face. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this one actually kind of looks like you. I don't see it. <laughs> it's eyes moved. I'm serious, dude. The little figurines, figurines eyes moved. Why are you always messing with me? Creepy? This mom was terrified when she woke up one day and saw this picture of her sleeping on her phone. Deborah's a stay-at-home mom, so at first she thought one of her kids must have just taken the picture to mess with her. But her youngest son had been staying with his dad that night, and looking at the timestamp of the photo, she noticed that it was taken one hour after her oldest son left for work, meaning that she was the only one home. To make things creepier, she says that she fell asleep with her phone underneath her pillow that night, and when she woke up, it was still in the exact same spot, and all of the doors in the house were locked. If I was her, I would probably move. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, all right check it. we went to this dam over the weekend i guess some kid fell on it back in the day and it's haunted so naturally bring the family and check it out right so i guess right. he was swimming and got sucked in one of these holes but there's holes all over the place and, and where it has you, you're supposed to be able to see his ghostly reflection something nah you ain't give me you, you got there a little bit i felt it oh, it's like a little triple okay. triple see, that, that's what i'm talking about like the triple oh yeah, Somebody's been living in our basement attic. So what was that? What, what, what was that? I don't know. Oh. Somebody was living in Oh, why did it? Oh, probably. I don't know. It said it happened. I feel like this is going to be a jump scare. And I do not want it to be a jump scare, bro. <clears throat> <laughs> like, it's like you waiting for it. Oh. Oh. No, I watched it. Okay, okay. 
Det är alldeles klart för att jag har fått What is this again, bro? What the fuck? What the fuck? I hate the video today. I think they try to do it just to make it longer. Oh, it's an update. Uh, so that's what I'm gonna do. There was a time when the fear of being buried alive was legitimate. Doctors couldn't always tell the difference between a coma and actual death, which led to some people waking up inside their own coffins. To avoid that, safety coffins were designed. A rope would be strung from the coffin to a bell above ground, letting anyone nearby know someone was still alive. One grave in Savannah's Bonaventure Cemetery still has a bell attached. You can see it on the side of the Charles F. Mills plot. But if you hear that bell ring, don't answer it. Charles has been dead since 1876. Wow. I saw this thing that a lot of people were doing on TikTok called Rando Nodding. It's an app that you download and it gives you a completely random location close to you that you go to and apparently it's supposed to be a glitch in the simulation or something like that. I don't really know if I believe it or not, so... I downloaded the app and I thought I'd try it out for myself. It gave me a spot in the middle of the woods that's kind of close to my house, but it looks like it's along ATV trails, so we're on the ATV and let's go see where it takes us. Alright, so we're at the location and this is... this is weird. There's a car just chilling in the woods. How did they even get in here though? Like, there's trees everywhere. There's no way a car could get in here. This car looks super old. No, no, stop, embra stop embracing for a, a jump scare. Okay, because I've just been going since I've been coming. I don't like it. It makes my head hurt. Holy shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. to a hospital. They give you a right wristband with your name on it, but there are different colored wristbands that mean other things. Purple wristbands are put on the people who don't want to be revived if they die. What? Yellow wristbands are put on the people who are at risk of falling, and red wristbands are put on the dead people. One night, a surgeon was working in the night shift at a hospital. She had just finished her operation and was headed down to the basement. She entered the elevator, and there's only one other person in there. The woman in the elevator had black hair and pale skin. She smiled kindly at the surgeon, but just something was a little off about her smile. Ooh, the surgeon chatted casually with the woman as the elevator went down. <laughs> when the elevator opened, a man was about to enter before the surgeon rushed to close the door and then pushed a button to the first floor. The other woman in the elevator looked at her in shock and asked her why she didn't let that man in. I just operated on him. He died during the surgery. Didn't you see the red wrist? I don't like that whisper shit. She ain't got a whisper. She got a whisper. Do you hear it? Like, yeah, I hear it. She's talking. She's saying stuff like. Oh, I'm about to say it. Like, blah, 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 my blah, 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 blah. Dad, I'm trying to hear it. I 
think if people be doing that shit on purpose, see if people gonna catch it. Mm-hmm. They do. Oh, that's a billboard. That's scary to look at. That don't fuck me like that. Why do they be scary ass? that was here with Danny and Sean. Yes. Have you spoke with us on our EVP recorder? We can hear your voice on there. It's, it's Yes. Like what? when we were in the big ass house, I'd be like, nah. Yeah. Maybe have Some a little passageway. Because that's what I'd be saying. Like, some of the houses be so big. Mm-hmm. Then when you get inside, it's like they only use a certain space. Like, yeah. okay, where's the where's other space? The... Like, oh! <laughs> Fuck me, it's not your bad time. What do we do? I missed it. Come from it. <laughs> 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 Stop giving me body shots. I don't have a body. <laughs> For real. <laughs> oh, my God, what the fuck? Well, that's... That was, that was a little lighter than what the normal yeah, videos real, yeah. were. I think because, like, it's quick. Yeah. Quick, 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 quick. So just, like, a lot of storytelling. And yeah, and sometimes stuff. stuff be fake. And, you know, like they trying to get that scary vibe. Yeah. So. I don't like when people be playing like the scary shit, like where the you music. know the music, like mm-hmm. speed it up and all types of shit. But hey, yeah, it was all right. It was, it was, all right. It was okay. It wasn't bad. Woo! The first one had me on the. I think mean, the second one was on scary. The ropes. The second one was scary. I don't think the second one was scary. Well, the first one. Was I think longer. the first the first one was was scary to me, but it briefed us for the second one. The yeah. only thing that was scary like that that, that, that that I said Netflix was the shit. The the. the the, yeah, the clinic the shit. Clinics. So, yeah. Y'all like, comment, subscribe. Let us know if this was scary to y'all. Do y'all just watch it on a daily basis? Don't give a F. Right. Uh, yeah. It was freaky for me. Yeah, freaky for me too. Good enough. Are we going to kiss right now? <laughs> <laughs> Knowing him. Hell yeah, give me a I'm kiss scared. girl. Let's get freaky. <laughs> hey, that's the best thing to do. But other than that, we got some next video. Peace.